up guys and thank you so much for tuning in to another video of as always Aaliyah where we always keep it real now in this video I am so excited because we will be discussing the full collection from Mayel the rice water collection let's get to it <laughs> So today, like I said, we're going to be discussing the full collection from my L. I was actually super excited to be trying this because I have not hopped on the rice water bandwagon just yet. I'm still all about my aloe. If you guys have not seen my aloe video, I will tag it up here somewhere so you can go check it out. I do have a part one and a part two. Uh, but back to this rice water, I am extremely excited to be trying out the rest of the pieces. I already went in with the moisturing milk and the clay mask in the shower but we will be discussing them in full in total right now so let's just go ahead and hop into it so guys this is not your average collection it does not really come with like a shampoo a conditioner a leave-in a mask and some type of cream and gel that's like a normal line or collection that we usually would see in the natural hair world however this rice water collection comes with a moisturizing milk a clay mask it also comes with some type of split in therapy which I'm really excited to hop into and it has a shine mist as well so it's again it's not your normal collection but it still shouldn't be treated any different so the the first thing I went in with the shower was a shampoo. They don't have a shampoo in this line, so I just got that good old TGIN, the Rosewater Collection. If you guys have not seen this, I did a full review on this collection as well. You can go check it out. I'll link it up here. You guys can check it out and also at the end of this video in the description below. I love the shampoo so much, and because they didn't have a shampoo in this line, I just had to go with the TGIN. So we'll just skip this part because it's not a part of the um, collection. So after the shampoo, I rinsed it out and I went in with the clay here's the clay right here guys So for this clay it is a clay mask rice water collection by my L there's not really that's anything standing out to me it does say that you need to apply this and leave it on for 15 to 30 minutes which I actually did the first ingredient I am seeing is water, which is great. There's also aloe leaf juice in here, which is awesome. There's sweet almond. I'm seeing sunflower, olive. I'm also seeing rice. But so far, so good. We are looking good with this product. This is how much I used in the shower right here, guys. Awesome consistency very cool love this stuff love how thick it is the smell is really good it smells clean I like it but the smell is not too overbearing that's what I really like about it like Mayel they don't have overbearing smells like the main choice may have like they're really fruity and fragrancy smells I'll be surprised if I actually see a fragrance in here oh I am seeing a perfume fragrance at the end of this okay well, I'm happy with it. It did the job. I was able to leave this on for 15 minutes. I set left um, under a plastic cap and just let it do its thing. And then I did wash it out. I was easily able to detangle my hair with the deep conditioning mask. So I went ahead and rinsed it out and just detangled my hair as the mask was coming out. And my hair was already detangled when I was ready for this moisturizing milk. OMG, this is what I put next in my hair. How cool is this stuff, guys? It has a different consistency. It really does. That's how it comes out. It is creamy. Very creamy. I love it. I really, really enjoyed this stuff. My hair really enjoyed this stuff. It was absolutely amazing. So I used the moisturizing milk as a leave-in conditioner. That is the only thing that I have in my hair right now. My hair is fully detangled and it is ready to go and prep for the styling process. So without further ado, let's go ahead and start the process. You guys are probably wondering what the heck is she going to do with this collection? Because there's really no styling products. So we will be doing perm rods today i love me a little perm rod set here's my perm rods right here in my sheen bag like always 
and I am gonna have to go in with the TGIN Rosewater Defining Mousse. I did not get to use this yet because there is no styling product in this collection. I am gonna have to go ahead and just use the mousse that I have not tried yet. So without further ado, let's go ahead and just hop on into it. I'm gonna throw some perm rods in my hair. We're gonna see how this product performs with the rest of the collection. And I'll also be putting this on my roots and my ends as well. All right guys, let's go ahead and hop on into this hair. I do have a long tube sock wrapped around the perimeter of my head so nothing leaks out. I learned this trick from Natural 85. Shout out to you, girl. All right, and I did keep my hair in a plastic bag just so it could, the moisture can remain in the hair because you already know our hair gets dry so fast. So again, the only product that I have in my hair right now is that moisturizing milk. It's in there, so I'm gonna go ahead and just part my head. Before I go in and style it, I am gonna go ahead in with this. It doesn't say to shake it or anything. So I'm gonna go ahead and just open it. I'm gonna squeeze the top and release it so there is a little bit in there. This is how it comes out just like that. Yeah, smells normal. Nothing pleasing about the smell. And I'm going to go ahead and just put this on my scalp. Especially at the crown. I feel like my crown needs like the most love. It's the most manipulated part of my head. The sun is always hitting the crown of your head. So. This feels really good. I love little droppers like this. So I went, I went in with three little droppers in the back section. And then I'm gonna go ahead and put some in my hand too. Just like that. Here's the product. And I'm gonna go ahead and put this all in the back section. So we're good to go. <laughs> now we can go ahead and separate and start the styling process. All right guys, let's go ahead and get started. I do have my first section right here and everything else is, is up and out the way this stuff is really good by the way it just felt so nice to have that on your scalp it's still nice and wet in there and moisturized so it's pretty cool i am going to go ahead and just with one pump of this at first and see how that does maybe i should have took the perm rods out the bag but it's okay it's all right <laughs> I've never used the purple ones yet, so I think it's only right if we're trying a new collection. Why not try a new perm rod size? Uh, this is just a medium perm rod size. Nothing special about it. But the perm rods right here that we'll be using. All right, so I am going to go ahead and just brush it. Make sure all the kinks are out of my head. When you are putting perm rods in, you want a very flat surface to work with. I am going to go ahead and just use one more. The hair is back to moisture. Go ahead and pop that cap off. I'll start at the bottom here, wrapping the ends around. And then I'm going to just wrap the hair around the perm rod like so. That is the style that we will do today. All right. There it is. Do you guys like doing perm rods in your hair? Let me know in the comments below. Alright guys, I am going to go ahead and just knock out the back of my head and I will see you guys when I get to the front. Alright guys, so I did scoot up a little bit so I can get all up close and personal in your business. So I am going to go ahead, I did finish the back side guys. We're looking good back there. I am loving this purple. I love the thickness of the perm rod. So that's pretty cool, but we're going to go ahead and keep on moving. So let's go ahead and just take a nice size chunk. We'll just work with this right here in the back section. Part out a nice little cut. Looks good. And we'll pop everything else up out the way. This has been so much fun so far. So I have been taking just one pump of the mousse, well maybe just a half a pump because this isn't a lot in this section right here. Uh, you can definitely go overboard on the mousse, so just be careful because you do want it to dry. So I am going to go ahead and just brush it with my Felicia Leatherwood. And we're going to go ahead and take a purple perm rod. 
I always flip it upside down and I start my ends on this part. It's just easier when I take it out. As you can see, my ends are being wrapped around. Make sure they're nice and fully covered. And then I start to twist. There's a couple different techniques that you can use with perm rods. Today, this is the technique I'm using. You're gonna get such a nice spiral with this perm rod. So that's pretty cool. All right, let's keep moving. Alright guys, so I am finished my head. I just went ahead and installed these. It took maybe about 45 minutes to go ahead and put all these in my head. Uh, my hair is pretty wet right now, so I am going to let it dry. Uh, I am hoping that it will dry pretty fast, but we will see. If I do have to sit under a hooded blow dryer, I will to make it dry or use my handheld blow dryer uh, with my attachment. I can do that too. So either way, I'm going to go ahead and let this dry and I will be back. And one last thing, I forgot to use this in the front, guys. I only put this in the back of my head, so when my hair is dry and I'm taking them out please well I can't say remind me because it's not like it's a live video but I'll try to remember to apply this when uh, my hair is being dry when my hair is dry and I'm taking out the curls I'll go ahead and put this in the front since I didn't get a chance to but I will catch you guys when my hair is dry and see you soon guys I am finally back and my hair is 100% dry fingers crossed I did sleep in these overnight and it's been about a little bit over 24 hours since I had these in my hair if you've ever slept with perm rods or flexi rods or any type of rod in your hair, you already know the horrible night I had sleeping. We don't even want to talk about it, but it's okay. I do have here with me the rice water collection from my L. This is the shine mist that I haven't used yet. And remember, I did not put the um, split in therapy in the front section, so I am going to go ahead and do that. I might drop a couple in the back, you know, I don't, I don't know yet, I don't know, but I really do like this stuff just I think it's the dropper I love this dropper it's amazing so I will be using these two after I take my curls out all right let's go Alright guys, so my hair is fully taken out, it is fully dry, it's fully styled, and I am fully happy. I don't really know if that made sense, but I am. Let us not forget, we did say that we were going to go ahead and put this in the front, so I'm just going to go ahead and take a little bit, just drop it in there where I need to. Oh, this feels so good. Oh yeah. I'm going to go ahead and just massage that in. This would even look like really cute in a mohawk, wouldn't it? This would look so cute. I might have to do a mohawk, guys. I really might have to do a mohawk one. This looks so cute. And a mohawk. I might do a mohawk tomorrow. I usually don't play in my hair like days one and two. Usually day three, that's when I start styling it. But like days one and two, I kind of just let it do its own thing. Let the curls kind of fill out on their own. And then I'll go in and style it on like day three. Like probably do like a mohawk or something. 
and we also have the shine mist right here this is how it comes out put that on the head Woo. smells really good like super fresh I feel like I just got out of a salon but I did it all for free <laughs> One thing I love about natural hair is you definitely can get those salon looks for the low. If you do it yourself, of course. These are the products, guys. Here they are right here. They styled my hair so lovely. I'm so happy to use this rice water collection by Myel. If you guys have not already, please go purchase. If you made it this far into the video, thank you so much for supporting me, for supporting my channel. Please like, subscribe, share, do what you got to do. I'm so happy I got to use the rice water collection from Myel. I am so happy with it. It was not your normal collection, but we still made it work. Okay, guys, I'm out of here. My name is Aaliyah. This is as always Aaliyah where we always ooh, Where we always keep it real. I'll catch you in the next one deuces